Hi students, this is your practice spelling test for the long E words. And what I encourage you guys to do, because this helped me when I was your guys' age, when I took spelling tests, I would write my spelling words five times each day, and then the night before my spelling test, I would give a practice spelling test. And one of the ways you can do a practice spelling test is by watching this video. So when I say a word, I'm going to give you guys a couple of minutes to write it down, or you can even pause it when I say the word to give yourself extra time to write it down and practice that way. But that's just like one of the great things you could do about this video is just to pause it and you can practice writing down the video and which whatever words that you did not get, you can rewrite them down um, five more times and practice the next day. And that's what helped me. But yes, this is your practice spelling test. So we'll go ahead and get started. But what I like it when I see students write on their spelling test is when they put their name on the top right hand corner. They put the type of test that so we're doing the long E this week. And then they put the date and number form. So we are in the month of April and we know that's the fourth month of the year. And our spelling test in the day, whatever we take the spelling test on and the year. Okay, but we'll go ahead and get started. Our first word is need. Need. Everybody needs water. Need. N. N. Now, what letter in the alphabet makes the N sound? N. N as in new or N as in nest. And if you said in, you are correct. N e d d d d as in dog. Need. Need. And need. And since there's a long emphasis on the e and need, there's got to be two. Okay. And our next word is going to be. Seat, seat, please take a seat. The movie is about to start, seat. S now what letter in the alphabet that's like a snake? S it's gonna be a S cause it's in the shape like a snake and it sounds like one. Eat, eat, seat. And if we take away the S, what word does that make? Eat. Mm -hmm. Okay, and our next word is going to be feel. Feel. It feels cold outside. Feel. Now, what letter in the alphabet makes the f as in f ish or f at or f an? And if you said f, you are correct. F eel eel. Now, if we take away the f, we get eel. Have you guys ever seen an eel from? The bottom of the ocean. They are very creepy, but you get the word eel. F eel. Feel. Okay, and our next word is Zeke. Zeke. We have a student named Zeke. Hi, Zeke. <laughs> Zeke. Now, what letter in the alphabet makes the z, z? Z. E. K. K. E. K. Z. E. K. Z. E. K. Okay, and our next spelling word is going to be meat. Meat. I will see you on the Google Meet. Meet.
Now, what letter in the alphabet makes the m, m, m as in monkey, m as in moose? M, it'll be the letter M, and then E, M, eat, meat. Okay, and our next spelling word is going to be these. These. Look at these cool toys. These. And I'll give you a hint on the, in, on the word these. It does have one of the diagraphs we studied. These. Now think, what diagraph makes... E s these the ease these okay and their next word is gonna be bean bean I do not like green beans but I love jelly beans bean Now, what letter makes the b, 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 as in boy, or as in b, and? It's going to be b, in, bean. Okay. In our next word, I would say it's probably the most tough, or it's the most challenging out of all of your spelling words. But your next one is going to be athlete, athlete. We have several athletes at our school. Athlete. A. Th. L. Eat. A. Th. L. Eat. Athlete. And your next word is going to be theme, theme. And it also has a diagraph. The e m. Theme, th theme, theme. Okay, and your last word is going to be read. Read, I love to read fiction books. Read. Read, read. Now, what letter in the alphabet makes er sound? Er. Er, eed, read. Er, eed, read. Okay, and that is your fake spelling test um, for the long E spelling word. And if you have any questions or if you want additional help from me, I'm more than happy to prep you guys before your spelling test on Friday. Just let me know. I'll be more than happy to help out. Thanks.